we're going to start this discussion of tree diagrams by reviewing some basic concepts of probability. And the first of these we're going to discuss is the probability scale itself. On this diagram it's represented by this straight line. The bottom end of the probability scale is a probability of zero. A probability of zero is the probability of an event which is impossible. So if an event has a probability of zero it cannot happen. To explain this concept further consider this box which contains red and blue balls. There are no balls of any other color in the box. The probability then of picking a pink ball from this box would be zero since there's no pink balls divided by the number of balls we can pick from and this comes to zero. It's impossible to pick a pink ball from the box and the probability of picking a pink ball from a box which only contains red and blue balls is zero. The other end of the probability scale is a probability of one. An event which has a probability of one is certain. This is an event that is definitely going to happen. For example, if you toss a coin you are going to get either a head or a tail. So the probability of getting a head or a tail when you toss a coin is 1. If we look at an intermediate point such as a half, this would be the probability of getting a head when we toss a fair coin. Another intermediate point would be one-sixth. This would be, for example, the probability of getting a six when we roll a die. It's worth noting that the probability scale goes from zero to one. When you're doing a question on probability, if you get an answer which is less than zero, or more than one, then you've done something wrong and you should check your working. 